Hi welcome on my channel Nativis. In today's video, I will teach you how to do this Zipa Zipa beautiful and very elegant bracelet. This project is very easy to do and the result is spectacular. This is a video request from Rai Quintana. She saw the video in Spanish and asked me to do it in English. Well, here you have it. I hope you like it and the rest of you too. The materials used pro crystal round bees, Swarovski crystal bicons and Mayuki civets. In the case of the information we'll say mostrar más, you click and you get a drop down with all the video information, the material unit and my networks. Anyway, we are going to stop. The materials unit. Pro crystal round bees 6 mm in white, Swarovski crystal bicons 4 mm in metallic blue, Mayuki CBs 110 in galvanized gold, a magnetic clasp, two young prints, scissors, a needle ten size, far line 0.18 mm, and pliers. Anyway, let's start. I have dressed my needle with a meter and half and pick up a 6 mm pro, a civet, a 6 mm pro, a civet, a 6 mm pro, a civet, a 6 mm pro, and a civet. This is the sequence for pros and for civets. Slot them down, make a loop. And pass again for all beats. Together, drapes and make three knots. And pass one more time for the next pro for the next civet and for the next pro. Slatten down and pick up a civet, a pro, a civet, pro, a civet, pro. And a civet. Look this. This sequence is what we will repeat until to have the length of our bracelet. And go through my needle on the opposite side of the same pro for here. And pull a thread. Look this. And now pass for the next civet, for the next pro, for the next civet, and for the next pro, and pull a thread. As you can see, I'm forming a square with pros, and this pro is part of the following square. Anyway, continue. Pick up a civet, a 6 mm pro, a civet, a 6 mm pro, a civet, a 6 mm pro, and a civet. Look this. And go through my needle for opposite side hole for the same pro and pull a thread.
pass for the next CV for the next pro for the next CV and for the next pro Repeat this step until to cut alone of the contour of your wrist. Let's go out measure the claps. As you can see, I finished it. For that serves as reference, the measurement is for bracelet of 18 centimeters. Now I'm going to make the loop from this end for to put claps. Pick at 8, 11 out CVs. and go through my needle for opposite side hole for the same pro and pass again for all this and for the same pro now pass for the fight CVs And we got four 11 out CVs and go through my needle for two 11 out CVs. They are in the middle in opposite direction and pull a thread and pass again for all these two more times. As you can see, I have a little dread and I will finish it. Now pass for the next three CVs. For the next Pro. For the next 11 out CV. For the next Pro. Now we put the needle between two Vs. Make a loop. Pass for the loot and pull a thread. Repeat one more time. Now pass for the next CV. For the next Pro. We put again the needle between two Vs. Make a loop. Pass for the loop and pull a thread. Repeat one more time. Pass for the next CV, for the next Pro, for the next CV, and for the next Pro. To put needle in between two Vs, make a loop and pass for the loop. And we remove the thread of the needle. Good, I have thread my needle with another meter and call of thread and I'll put it together with the previous thread. Good, pass my needle for Pro. I put my needle in between two Vs, make a loop, go through for the loop and pull a thread. Repeat one more time. Now together the two pieces of threads and make three knots. We cut a little glue and when it dry we burn it. Anyway, I continue. 
pass for the next 11 hours bit. M, we got two 11 hour CVs, four millimeter by comb, and two 11 hour CVs. This is the sequence. I'm going through my needle for this CV in diagonal. And go out for the next pro and pull a thread. And go through for the next C bit on the left. And repeat one more time this step. We cut two 11 out C bits. 4 mm bicon and 2 11 ounce CVs. I'm going through my needle for this CV in diagonal. I'm going to add for the next pro. And for the next CV on the left. Repeat this step until then. As you can see, I cut it almost finished. And now I'm going to put the last sequence. We cut two 11 ounce CVs, a bicon, and two 11 ounce CVs. I'm going through my needle for this CV in diagonal and go up for the next pro and pull a thread. And now I'm going to make the loop from this end for to put the other part of the clubs. Pick up 8 11 ounce CVs and go through my needle for opposite side hole for the same pro and pull a thread. And pass again for all this. And now pass for the fight CVs. We got four 11 ounce CVs. And go through my needle for two CVs in the middle in opposite direction. For here. And pull a thread. And pass again for all this. Now pass for the next three eleven hour CVs. For the next CV and for the next pro and for the next CV. To put my needle in between two CVs, make a loop and go through for the loop and pull a thread. Repeat one more time. Pass for the next CV. For the next pro. For the next CV,
um, to put needle in between CVs, make a loop and go through for the loop and pull a thread. Repeat one more time. Sorry. Now go through for the next pro and for the next civet. Together drapes and make three knots. Cut the rest and finish work. Now I'm going to put the claps. Take jump print, open, put in one end, put the bracelet for a claps frame and close. And the other end, the same, open jump ring, put in the other end, and for the other clap swim, and close. This is the result, a beautiful and very elegant bracelet, very very nice, just for today's video. If you like the video, subscribe to my channel, finger up and share the video in social networks. A kiss and thanks for seeing me. Bye bye.